I wanted to pair my Apple Watch with my new iPhone 6 and that didn't really work. The problem was that my Apple Watch was still paired with my previous phone, the iPhone 5. So I decided to film the solution for this problem. The first thing you'll have to do is unpair your Apple Watch from your previous phone, so mine is the iPhone 5. You'll have to fill in all your passwords and settings and stuff, make sure you have a copy of your uh, iWatch. And then it will take a couple of minutes before the unpairing is complete. Your Apple Watch will need to restart and reboot, so that will take a little while. After your iPhone restarted, you'll have to go through some different settings, like choosing your language, for me that's Dutch. And after that's done, you'll get the option to pair your iWatch with your iPhone. The easiest thing to do is letting your iPhone recognize the iWatch and that happens pretty fast. As you can see, my iPhone already paired with the iWatch and he also discovered that it has a previous version installed. If you want to start from scratch with your iWatch, you can do that, but you can also use the backup that has been saved on your iCloud. What you'll have to do now is wait, and I advise you to take a drink and wait. Et voilà, your iWatch is paired with your new iPhone. I would say, have a lot of fun, thank you for watching this video, and I hope you learned something from it.